Braj Bhasha is a Western Hindi language. Along with Awadhi, a variety of Eastern Hindi, it was one of the two predominant literary languages of North Central India before the switch to Karaboli in the 19th century. Braj Bhasha is spoken by people in the nebulously defined region of Raja Bhumi, which was a political state in the era of the Mahabharata Wars. According to ancient Hindu texts such as the Bhagavata Purana, the kingdom of Surasena is described as spreading through the bridge also known as Vraya or Vraja, where the incarnation of Vishnu, Krishna was born and spent his childhood days. This region lies in the Agra Mathura Aligarh area, and stretches as far as the environs of Delhi. In modern India, this area lies mostly in northwestern Uttar Pradesh, the eastern extremities of Rajasthan i.e. Bharatpur and Dolpur and the southern extremities of Haryana. Northern regions of Madhya Pradesh like Morena are also included. Today Braj Bhumi can be seen as a cultural geographical entity rather than a proper state. It is the vernacular of the region and boasts a rich culture and literature by famous poets like Sirtas, Bai Gurdas and Amir Khusro. Bridge Basha is very close to Awadhi, spoken in the neighboring Awa region. Much of the Hindi literature was developed in Braj in the medieval period. However, today Karaboli dialect has taken its place as the predominant standard dialect of Hindi. In modern India, Braj Bhasha exists as an unofficial dialect spoken colloquially by natives of the region of Braj Bhumi, with great cultural and religious significance. Much of Hindi poetry, especially that of bhakti or devotional poetry is in this language. Some devotional poems for Krishna are also composed in Braj Bhasha. The pioneering Urdu poet Amir Khusro, also spoke and composed poetry in this language. Famous Braj Basha folk songs or poems include Chop Tilak Sab Chini by Amir Khusro, and the popular devotional song, Main Nahan Makan Kayo by Sirtas. Braj Basha is also the main language of Hindustani classical music compositions. Topic geographical distribution Braj Basha is mainly a rural tongue currently, predominant in the nebulous Braj region centered on Mathura and Agra in Uttar Pradesh and Bharatpur and Dolpur in Rajasthan. It is the predominant language in the central stretch of the Ganges Yamuna Dobe in the following districts Hathras Mathura Agra Aligar Farahabad Oreya Eta Mainpuri Etawa Bulanshar Noida Farikabad Kaskanj Badan It stretches across the Ganges into the non Dobi districts of Badan and Bareilly and goes up to the foothills of Nainital at Udham Singh Nagar in Uttarakhand. Besides Uttar Pradesh, it is spoken in the bordering areas of Rajasthan, mainly in the following districts, Bharatpur Dalpur as well as parts of Karauli, from where onwards it merges into Rajasthani languages. It is also spoken in the eastern areas of Uttar Pradesh, mainly in Mathura district and eastern areas of Palwal and Noida districts. In Madhya Pradesh it is spoken in the districts of Behind, Morena, Gwalior, and Shivpuri. It is spoken in several villages of Mathura, especially in Vrindavan, Madhuvan, Kaman, Kosi Kalan, Baldeo, and all other villages belongs to Braj area with Baina, Sarir, Bidani. Literature Most Braj Basha literature is of a mystical nature, related to the spiritual union of people with God, because almost all of the Braj Basha poets were considered God-realized saints and their words are thus considered as directly emanating from a divine source. Much of the traditional northern Indian literature shares this trait. All traditional Punjabi literature is similarly written by saints and is of a metaphysical and philosophical nature. Another peculiar feature of northern Indian literature is that the literature is mostly written from a female point of view, even by male poets. This is because the saints were in a state of transcendental, spiritual love, where they were metaphorically women reuniting with their beloved. In its inversion of the conventional genders of worshipper and worshipee, Maulana Daud's Chandayan departs from this tradition. Important works in Braj Basha are Yugala Shataka by Swami Sri Srabhata Devakarya, known as the first Vani book in Vraja Basha composed in the 14th century AD as a part of Nimbarka Sampradaya tradition of Radha Krishna worship. Vinaya Patrika by Tulsidas Sir Sagar by Sirtas Buddha Charit by Acharya Ram Chandra Shukla Sufi poetry by Amir Khusro Eulogies by Kavi Bhushan V. Rind Satsai by V. Rind (1643–1723), court poet of ruler of Kishangar. Topic: 
Basic phrases of the bridge basha sample sentences. Topic See also Hindi literature Brajavali dialect Brajabulai